Hey guys, should we start another blog? I think so. I'm having a lot of fun with these blogs. So today, um, it's kind of a fun day. So Emily's in spring break, so she's gonna go out with her friends. And my sister and I, we are gonna have a little sister day and we're just gonna go to Disney Springs for a little bit. Um, we're gonna go eat some pizza and maybe drink some coffee and just hang out. Um, I go back to work in a week and a half, so I need to start moving and, you know, getting my body to, like, move. Because right now, every time that I move, I, I'm just so tired and I get so fatigued and everything from surgery still. So I need to, like, get moving and let my body know, hey, wake up, it's time to, you know, live life. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna push myself a little. Of course, I'm not going to hurt myself, but I am going to push myself a little bit and try to do as much walking as I can. So, that's the plan. That's what we're going to do. Um, right now, I'm just going to start getting ready. I'm going to take a shower, do my hair, and do my makeup. And, yeah, just get ready and wait for her to come over. I'm going to drink my vitamins right now. So right now what i am taking is i'm taking i'm taking maca i am gonna take my ray beauty drops i am gonna take two of these because i'm trying to finish the bottle so i'm gonna take two of these and and i also take calcium because of my bones so that's what I take in the morning, and then later on I'll show you what I take at night. I can just show you now. Um, so I, I started drinking these vitamins. Um, they are for women 50 and over, but because I'm already in menopause, <laughs> lucky me, I get to um, drink these. So I'm trying these out. They're the Whole Love multivitamin for women 50 with extra support for healthy bones and relief of sick symptoms of menopause so i'm trying these and then i'm also taking the somegas i think this has called uh your crucial daily dose of omega-3 support so i'm taking those at night before bed and yeah so right now i'm just gonna drink my vitamins and I also want to try the Truly and Powerpuff Girls shaving stuff. So I'm going to bring you along for that. So yeah, let's do this. So I'm going to show you guys a little um, haul here <laughs> that I got the other day. So on my last vlog, Emily and I went to Five Below and we also went to TJ Maxx. I also have a package here for, from Miss A. Emily was going to open it and I was like, no, that's for the video. <laughs> so I'm hoping I can film this either today or tomorrow. So that's that. But over here we have the main thing that I went out to look for is this stool. And this is going to go in my shower. I do have, and it was only $5, I do have a little one in my shower already, but it's too short. Um, so like right now that I just had surgery, I can't really bend that well. So this is going to help me. And also, um, for my back problems, I can't bend that well either for shaving and stuff. So this is going to help me and it was only $5 and it's so cute. Um, and then I bought this reusable bag. It was only 99 cents or 25 cents. No, it was only 25 cents actually. Um, so I got this reusable bag. I need to put it in my car so that I can use it all the time. Um, but Emily got this set of plants. They were only five dollars. It's the Energize um, Energize something grow kit. <laughs> it comes with a wake cactus, center succulent, and evolve sage so she's gonna grow these little plants in her room and she also got this uh what is it infused cannabis no hemp seed oil infused lip oil 
from Gina Beauty. She got that. And then I got two palettes. Well, Emily got one, I got one. So they have these cute little LA color palettes. The first one here, it's What's the Tea Matcha Mix, and it's like greens and browns, and it's really cute. And then I got this one, which is Let's Talk Tea Chai Latte palette, and it's like a, it's like a cool tone natural palette, so I'm going to try that. If you saw my last blog, I blocked a little bit of the makeup section at five below. So, and then we went to TJ Maxx, which is right next door. Um, nothing interesting. I just got some sponges for dishes, and they were $2.99. I really like these because it has the soft and the hard piece over here, but these last a while, so got those. I can't find my lash curler anywhere, so I got this one. This is the Aesthetic Plus. Um, eyelash curler. I thought it looked really nice and it's $3.99. And then Emily got some stuff for her friend's birthday so we got her this scrub and this was $5.99 from Body Prescriptions in Roshek. And we also got her a bath bomb and this is the Sexy Bomb, a Velvet Orchid bath fisher with a surprise inside so and this was $3.99 so we got her that stuff and that is everything that we got at the store actually no there's a few more things but they're downstairs so I'll show you guys later but this is what we have so far let's go and uh, shave our legs okay guys so I'm in my bathroom <laughs> and the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this which is the Power Shine Pre Shave Serum and Watermelon and Strawberry. So I'm gonna use this because it says you have to put it in the skin and let it soak. So we're gonna use this first. Let's try the body butter and see how this is. This is the Avocado Kiwi um, aftershave cream. So it's so cute. <laughs> it's like a rainbow. Let's see if I don't kill myself with this damn chair. There's so much. Okay, let's see. It's more on the thicker side. This feels very thick. I don't know if I like this actually. It feels very, very, very thick. And it turns more into like a, like an oil. But it's very thick.
so we are in a Target. I haven't vlogged in a couple of days just because I haven't really done anything exciting. I did spend the day with my sister yesterday, but I didn't want to vlog or anything. I just kind of wanted to like spend time with her. Um, but we are in Target. I need to get some stuff, so I thought I'll bring you along. And um, yeah, let's do this. start to my day today is monday i go back to work on thursday of this week i am feeling a lot better thank god um i still get a lot i still get a lot tired but um i can't wait to go back to work i just i love going to very work. very excited um but like i said i do still get tired like i shaved my legs this morning and I was very much out of breath by the end of um, the process. Um, I also got very lightheaded, so I had to lay down for a little bit um, just because I was bending a lot of stuff. So I think that I'm not quite like ready to go crazy, <laughs> but you know, it is what it is. So today I am going to do some laundry, I'm going to do some declutter videos, and I'm also going to go to the gym with my sister. Um, yes, I know what you're thinking. I'm trying not to go crazy, and yet I'm going to the gym, right? Well, I need to start getting my body to its normal routine. So, and I'm ready, you know, I've, I've seen videos, and the doctor, talked to the doctor, and, um, done some research and everybody says you know to go back to your regular activities when you feel like you're ready and I'm ready so I'm not gonna push myself too hard I'm just gonna walk in the treadmill for maybe like 20 minutes or so um I'll play it by ear if I feel like I can go to 30 then I'll go but if not I'll stop at 20 and call it a day I'm just gradually gonna do things slowly until I get back to my regular exercising which it's a little bit more brutal than 20 minutes on the treadmill <laughs> but yeah I need to get back to the gym because I love it it's it's like my mental therapy the gym I love it so yeah I'm very excited about getting to the gym today and uh, I cut my hair also and it feels so much better I think that I told you guys in either a blog or a video or something that my hair was just so dry and it wasn't doing anything and the person that cut it last just did a terrible job so I went and got my hair cut at this place where all of my co-workers or where two of my co-workers that I trust go. So um, I have to say that I'm very, very happy with the results. I wasn't planning on cutting it any more shorter than it was, but there was a lot of dead end in my hair. So we cut all that off and it feels so much better. But like I said, I am getting a late start to my day, which means, sorry for the camera, uh, which means that it is like almost one o'clock so i'm gonna have a brunch not a lunch the reason why i'm getting such a late start is because i wasn't really able to sleep last night and that's one of the side effects of having menopause um but i have been doing really really good until yesterday and so i couldn't sleep last night so i kind of slept for like two extra hours this morning and then you know you get a lazy start and took a shower and then your day is kind of going by super quickly but i'm gonna have some brunch i'm gonna show you guys what i'm having today is day one of getting back to my healthy routine and my healthy eating and going back to the gym and all that stuff so i'm gonna show you guys what i am eating so because i am having like a brunch um and i'm also going to the gym i need to you know have my energy so I made myself two avocado toast I used one full avocado and then two toast and then these toasts are like whole wheat toast but they're cut 
thinner than your regular toast um so i am excited to try those i put a little bit of salt on top i of course have my water and i also made myself a smoothie and this smoothie has spinach it has strawberries pineapple peach blueberries um it has uh flax seeds chia seeds or chia seeds however you want to say it um and it also has ginger powder and i made it with oat milk but it's like a different type of oat milk um if i remember i'll either insert a picture or i'll show you the box downstairs um and then i put some of my protein powder in here just because like i said i'm going to the gym today so i need to have my energy and it's a brunch so i'm kind of eating two meals in one so I made myself that. I'm very excited to try to drink my smoothies with milk instead of water and see if it affects my heartburn. I do have to say that last night my heartburn was horrendous and I did have a smoothie yesterday. So I'm going to try it again today and see how that goes. Um, and then I also, I also have my tea over here. And if you guys don't know, I drink a detox tea. So it's the Limpton detox tea um, every single morning. So I have that. And then I also put a regular bag of green tea as well to go along with it. So I'm going to drink that as well. Lots of liquids, which is good because it'll make you go to the bathroom and clean your system out. So... Let me show you guys what I've been working on. I haven't vlogged in a few days because I've been like a busy bee cleaning my room because uh, this room was suffocating me, suffocating me because I have so much stuff. So the first thing I did was clean my closet. I'm sorry, the light is not working. I have to um, have my landlord people come and look at it because I changed the bolt, but it's not, it's not working, so. I have to um, call them for that, but I cleaned my closet. I just have some stuff over there. This used to be all full. I've already decluttered my clothes, so these are all the clothes that I'm keeping. These are all my gym clothes. These are all my regular clothes, and then these are all dresses, so I do have a system to my madness over here. And then I have all of my sweaters and jackets and all that good stuff. Um, I have some stuff on the floor that I have to show you guys uh, from my other uh, shopping trips that I did. And then I have my shoes over here. And then you guys, don't judge me for what I'm about to show you. But I go through candles a lot. So this is my stash of candles. <laughs> I have all of my candles here. The only candles that I do not have here are the majority of my Christmas candles because I have those in a... Um, in a, um, what do you call it, a clear, a clear bin in the closet downstairs. I only have a couple of Christmas candles back here. Uh, but other than that, these are my everyday candles. And I love them so much. <laughs> I love every single one of my candles. Um, these candles right here are kind of sentimental. So I don't think that I will be burning those. Um, just because this one reminds me of Twilight, which is my favorite books, movies. I just, I love Twilight. I know, I'm a Twilight person. I'm sorry if you don't agree with me, but I am a Twilight person. So, um, I love this because it reminds me of Twilight. And then this is from, um, the Gilmore Girls. And that is a very special show for my daughter and myself because we can relate to it big time. So, <laughs> I had to get something from the Alta and Gilmore Girls collection and I decided to go with the candle. And then this one I love so much because look it looks just like my cat Olivia I love this candle so much I got this one at TJ um and once I burn it it is a uh, Christmas candle of course by the title winter pine um so once I'm done burning it I'm just gonna keep this as either like a coaster or just some kind of decoration <clears throat> during Christmas time so, but yeah, that is my stash of candles. I also have like Dollar Tree candles over here that I usually burn in the bathrooms. And then I also have my stash of, um, of my plugs as well. 
so yeah this is just my little section i know it's not crazy but it is crazy and then i also have more candles down there that i'm gonna show you guys later <laughs> i know i know but i burned them so quickly i have three all over my room right now so and then i have some downstairs as well so i do go through candles pretty quickly i also have one in my bathroom and one in the bathroom downstairs so like i said i burn candles pretty quickly so every time the bath and body works has a cell i i, I go get candles um and then yeah it's just some other stuff over here i have my weights right there and then these two boxes um this first box right here has my wedding dress and all of my wedding stuff I am separated from my husband, but I'm not ready to get rid of it. Um, you know, I don't know if my daughter might want to see it someday, so I have it right there. And then the top box right here contains all of the um, special things that I kept from my son. Um, if you guys have been around my channel for a while, you guys know that my son passed away uh, a few years ago. And so I kept all of um, the most important things in that box. I don't know why I always, every time that I talk about that box, I get emotional. But, okay. Whew. So yeah, so I've just been cleaning. I decluttered a lot of this. Um, in this shelf up here, I just keep all of like my God Bibles um, and my God books. God Bibles, really, Carla? <laughs> I keep all of my Bibles and my God books up there and then just some little cute things that are sentimental for me. And then my pops up there, which I love. Um, my spirit animal is Sadness, which she's right there, so beautiful. I love Harley Quinn and of course, the hottest man on the planet, Jason Momoa. Oh, he's so hot. Um, anyways, I also have all my perfumes, which I'm thinking about doing a declutter of my perfumes as well because there's a lot of perfumes that I don't use. These are all of my Britney Spears perfumes, and then over here we have all of my other perfumes. And then I have to take this stuff downstairs, that's why it's here. But I also cleared all of this. Um, I just kept those um, face mists right there and then I kept this one over here and then same thing down here <laughs> I'm in the process of cleaning but yeah I just put my romance novels <laughs> right there and then some makeup to the side and then all of my other books all of my Twilight books down there um, I told you guys I love Twilight and then I love um, autobiographies as well so those are all the new books. Like I said, I'm just cleaning and I'm decluttering. But guys, let me show you. I need to declutter my makeup because this and this and this and all of this and over there is insane. So I'm going to be decluttering my makeup and then, I don't know, maybe in a future video, I'll tell you guys what I plan on doing with all of this makeup because a lot of it is unused, untouched. So, yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing today. I'm probably not going to get to every single category of makeup today, but I want to at least get through all of this right here. So, yeah, um, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Hey, guys. So, we are at the gym. I am waiting for my sister to get here. Um, and then we're going to go and head in. Like I said, I'm only going to do like the treadmill for like 30 minutes or so and then we'll see how I feel. I'm kind of excited. I am so, so, so excited because yeah, I haven't been to the gym in a while so I'm very, very excited. Also, I got this new thing to like hold my phone when I'm in the car and I'm kind of liking it. I mean, it's kind of... I don't know how it's gonna look like if I'm actually driving, but I like it. <laughs> I wish it was my, more like over here, but it doesn't want to work anywhere but the glass. So I might have to put it a little lower, not so high, but it's working, so yay. Um, 
Okay, so I'm just gonna wait for my sister. Thought I'll check in. So you guys, I'll show you what I got at Bath and Body Works. It's not a whole lot, but I still want to show you guys because I know that Bath and Body Works is always fun to watch. So I got my sister a few things. Um, my sister's birthday is coming up in June. Um, but I didn't want to wait because they're Easter stuff, but she's been into like bunnies lately. <laughs> and so I got her, um, this cute little, um, hand wash, um, some bunny loves you. <laughs> and there's a cute little bunny right there. So I got her that. I'm going to give it to her today. We're going to go to Disney for a little bit. So I'm just going to give it to her today. And then the body spray, which smells like Tutti Fruity candy. And also the um, hand cream or the body cream. And it's Easter, but she loves bunnies, so I'm going to give them to her today. So that was the first thing I got. I also got um, one of the body creams for myself. Because the little travel size is buy one, get um, buy two, get one free. So I got me a body cream as well. Got some candles. Um, this particular day they were having a sale on candles for $12.95. So I ordered a bunch of candles and then I just picked them up in store. That way I didn't have to worry about the shipping. But the first candle I picked up is this watermelon watermelon lemonade. Um, and it smells really, really good. And I'm just obsessed with watermelon, so I had to pick up that scent. I also got my favorite scent in the entire Bath and Body Works line. This is Black Cherry Merlot. It smells so good. I also love, um, I think it's called Beautiful Day or something like that. And it smells like um, green apples. But I don't think they make a candle in that scent. Um, then I also picked up Pink Prosecco Frosting. But I haven't smelled this one. Let me smell it and see what it smells like. No, oh, it smells really good. It's very sweet. I love sweet scents, as you guys can tell. <laughs> um, I do like, like, clean scents and some floral scents, but for the rest of the house. Um, for my room and stuff, I prefer, like, sweet scents. And for downstairs, too. I also got pink pineapple sunrise and this packaging is beautiful so beautiful and the last candle that I got is sweet red mango so like as you guys can tell I love sweet scents <laughs> I also only picked up one little thing from Alpha um, they're doing their 21 days of beauty style and I just wanted to try the Lancome Idol mascara. So that's the only thing that I picked up from um, Ulta. Very proud, if I do say so myself, because I always walk out of there with more than I need. So yeah, just a quick little Bath & Body Works haul.